So for the topping on the shepherd's pie, I want to go right into that. So I've already pre-prepped the shepherd's pie. And again, the ingredients are on the website. And it's um, ground beef and turkey and some beautiful uh, local farm veg with some organic tomato. So here we go in our casserole dish right here. So you can top this, again, you can top this with cheese. And if you're not doing dairy, don't top it with cheese. That, I mean, that works too. It, it's super flavorful and it's got enough of your high fat content that you don't have to worry about it either way. I like my, my topping to just have um, a little bit more texture. So I don't break it down until it's super smoothie. I keep it just, um, I keep some bigger chunks in it. Because I, I like, um, again, I just like how that eats. I like how I just throw in eats in there really quick. Little uh, self promo. Terrible, absolutely terrible. All right, so this is what this baby looks like. And again, you can top it with cheese or not. I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of cheese on top, right down the middle. And I'm going to throw that in the oven. 350 degrees, depending on how thick it is, anywhere from 25 to 45 minutes. Okay, so the shepherd's pie is done. We're going to go ahead and plate that. If I can get this bad boy out of the oven. Holy cow. Gorgeous. Oh, it smells delicious. It's fall. It smells like fall. I love hearty, warming fall foods. So let's go ahead and get this on a plate. Still bubbling, my goodness. That is hot. All right, come on, baby. Yum, yum. Mm-hmm, real good. That's really good. It's terrible that I'm surprised. All right, fall all in one bite.